This is where we, we belong. This is our time. It's our chance to speak to out. Talk back to Sir Paul Kirch, Chairman of the Committee for Scientific Investigation of Claims of the Paranormal. Founded in 1975 to provide a possible alternate answer to psychic claims. Studied the existence of supernatural power. Always believed in an open-minded approach to these claims. We believe that NOVA has made a very rare error in the program content office. We saw the suspects capture Clarice, so me and Emmanuel chased them. Did you manage to catch up to them? <sighs> yeah, me and Emmanuel attacked them and they started open fire. They started shooting at us and we heard around the bullets. So we went back and retaliated against them. Then all of a sudden, you guys pulled up and just started arresting me. So with the metal rod, how did that happen? No clue at all. I have no clue at all. You do know what you did before the metal rod came was a criminal act, right? Those guys deserve it. Jerome's dead. So be it. Hey, Sam, is he in there? Yes, he is. Emmanuel Austin, born January 27th, 1988. He is from Washington, D.C. He is six feet tall, weighs 185 pounds, college graduate from Morgan State. Joined the armed forces for a short term and is boyfriend of the victim, Clarissa Thompson. Let me ask you something, Detective. What happened last night? Yeah, it was an accident? I'm not sure, Lieutenant James. Of course you're not sure. Let me tell you something. What happened last night was no accident. It's a murder. Whoa! How do you think it was a murder? There's no proof. Okay, uh... You seem like a smart guy. You ever heard of telekinesis? It's the power of the mind to move matter at a distance. Very good. My crazy uncle, he studies that. He's actually able to move small objects with his mind. But he was a musician. Don't cut me off. He predicted one day somebody would come along and unlock the powers of telekinesis. Psychokinesis. So this guy knows telekinesis? Yes, he does. I'm going to prove to you that he knows it. This guy's insane. Mr. Patterson? Yes, he is. Mr. Patterson is a friend of Austin. They both served in the Army and graduated from the same school. Come on, be honest with me. Do you have any backstory to how Clarice Thompson got killed? No, I don't. You are in a very tough situation right now. You need to be honest with me. I'm asked one more time, do you have any backstory to what happened? I don't have any information whatsoever. If you want information, talk to Emmanuel. Emmanuel knows. He must be hiding something. He is hiding something. Maybe he's telling the truth. I'd rather find out for myself. We'll take it from here. Michael, don't play dumb with us. Do any of you have any connection with what happened last night with Clarice Thompson? Like I told her, sir, I had nothing to do with what happened last night. Overall, I was trying to save Clarice. Bring him in, you one. Have a seat. How you doing, Emmanuel? I guess you're feeling bad. First of all, Emmanuel, I'm very sorry for what happened to Clarice last night. Now, what can you tell us about what happened? Last night, me and Michael went out for some drinks. Later on, he dropped me off in my crib. Once I got inside the house, I heard Clarice screaming. Once I heard Clarice screaming, I went out, I see the guys taking her away from my house. And then I said, let her go. And then later on, I see Mike just come out and just attack the guys from behind. When he attacked the guys from behind, it was already too late. They always slit her throat. After they slit her throat, what happened? The neighbor from next door came by, grabbed her, 
put her inside our house, called 911. It's called 911. Uh, me and Mike was chasing the guys. They had like a little car chase. We chased the guys. He say things what do you mean by things like I don't know things happen so fast like let me be clear about this when I say things I mean how did the metal object hit that man I don't know what you're talking about because I got nothing to do with the rock killing that guy I think you killed him I didn't kill him I know you killed him the fuck you talking about I think you're taking this outer line and I believe Emmanuel is innocent Man, it's time you take this serious. You're in some shit. Listen to me. You've been charged with disturbing the peace and attempted murder. In case you forget. You need to be really serious about this. I know you have telekinesis. I'm sure you're hiding it. Telekinesis? What are you talking about? This man is clearly innocent and it was self-defense! He's lying right to your face. You can't see that? So you're saying I got telekinesis abilities? Yes, I do. And why do you keep saying he's innocent? Because clearly there is no such thing as telekinesis, sir. You keep saying I'm innocent, but I'm still stuck here with these stupid handcuffs. What's the deal? The deal is this. If you don't show us your telekinesis, a lot of people you care about, it will be hurt. You can't be serious. I'm very serious. I've got people to pull a plug on your fiance without hesitation. Now, you want to see your fiance alive again, right? You show me your telekinesis. That was crazy. Yeah, yeah, it was. Extremely, like, damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, he held her on, man. You know, but like, all I can say is, man, she's here right now. Oh, keep me. You know what? You're right. You're right about that. I'm thinking I'm about to take this. I think I have something to say right now. I got something to say. Uh, Alright, um, I have everybody's attention, please. Uh, I'd like to say thank you everybody for coming. I know I'm in a very short notice. Uh, I know I've been such an asshole for the past couple of days. I know it's not fair to y'all, not fair to me, because I've been going through a lot in the last couple of days. Especially you, Clarice. Um, Clarice, uh, can you step up front, please? You can like, come to me. Uh, Y'all know that me and Karee's been together for like almost a year and I know I have not been committed to you but I'm willing to take my commitment to the next level. Oh. What? So Clarice, Heather Thompson. Can you marry me? I didn't know he was going to take it this far. Alright, I think we've seen enough. Come on, Emmanuel! Let me go! Sam? Back up, back up! We need back up now! So what you here for, man? That massacre downtown, what are you here for? Robert. Robert. Robert, that guy was killed. Yeah, he
What's going on? Where'd he go? 